Now, the College of New Jersey is bridging the gap between artists who are oceans away. Bergen Community College played host to a world-class clarinetist from Italy this week. Lisa Wojtyki reports. <laughs> It's the final notes of the rehearsal for the show entitled Walking Between Different Visions. After communicating by email for the past few weeks, world-renowned clarinetist Guido Arbanelli and internationally acclaimed dancer Lynn Needle only have a few hours to rehearse in person the performance of Namaste Suite. I have the pleasure to know this uh, royalty. In Italy, we have not this kind of school with this uh, preparation, with this uh, organization. The concert is part of three held every year, and this one is obviously taking place during the summer semester. The great thing about it is that music students can come and see present works performed live. Arbanelli teaches at the conservatory in Adria, Italy. He is a classical performer, but in this performance he will master pop music, classical, and contemporary music. Namaste Suite is a set of one-minute compositions written by four women from Greece, Canada, Italy, and the U.S. Namaste Suite, uh, it's uh, an Indian greeting, greetings, and uh, means uh, I honor in you where the paradise live. It's a message of unity, love, and joy. And Needle, who's toured internationally, chose to portray it through the morphing stages of a butterfly. I wanted to delve into the world of abstraction, so I thought what better world than the world of insects in the garden. Her mask was made by a homeless person from New Orleans in 1986. The costume was made by renowned costume designer Annie Hickman and the slide projection by a lighting designer in her 90s. Needle, who is also an adjunct at Bergen Community College, says Dr. Linda Marcel, director of the performing arts program here, made this international collaboration possible. It's a very fleeting ex collaborative experience and to me that's the essence of the butterfly is it's fleeting. You see them and their beauty and they make an impact and then they're gone. And dance is an ephemeral art form. It's, it's here and then gone you know in the moment so unless it's recorded on film you only have that magic in the theater to see it unfold. Reporting for WMBC News, I'm Lisa Wojtyki.